slope and the y-intercept in this equation. Again, we have to rewrite the equation in, in y equals mx plus b form. So we have the quantity, meaning negative x plus 8, is being divided by 2. So we've got to divide negative x by 2 as well as 8 by 2. So when doing that, we have y equals negative x divided by 2 plus 8 divided by 2. Now, we can obviously go ahead and simplify this. Um, this, can, you can't divide 2 into x. However, we can understand that there is a 1, a negative 1, being multiplied by the x. So when you want to rewrite this and understand what is m, then we can simply rewrite this as a negative 1 half x. And then 8 divided by 2 is 4. So we could say m is equal to a negative 1 half. And our y-intercept is 0, 4. Anybody have any questions? The other thing to notice is whenever you have a negative slope, please note, guys, negative 4 divided by 2 is equivalent to 4 divided by negative 2. So it doesn't matter if the negative's in front or in the bottom. I write it in, the, in front, but then negative could go above or below. Yes? Uh, does that same strategy work for number four? So for number 4, I'm assuming the 1 plus 6, y plus 6. Right. So yes, so the slope in that case would be 1 fourth x. Yep. Anybody have any other questions on this? Everybody feels good?